Hey there, it's my fourth year doing Extra Life. Once again, I'm playing for Johns Hopkins, and once again, I'm doing it because they saved my oldest daughter's life twice in her first two years of life. Uh, once again, I'm going to be doing um, either push-ups or sit-ups. Um, if you donate, for every dollar you donate, uh, as an incentive, a way to give something a little fun for, for your donations. And I'll be matching um, dollar for dollar uh, for the first uh, little bit. So the earlier you donate, the further your donation goes. Um, remember, we're doing this for the kids, so any amount you can donate would be great, and it helps a lot of kids get access to care they otherwise wouldn't. So thank you very much, and enjoy whatever game I'm just about to play. Bye. It's time for Eric Plays Multiplayer Civ. All right, I noticed last time I was hitting the red a bit, so I'm gonna drop my f levels, that should be better. Hey guys, how's it going? Um, so you'll notice um, there's more of me now. Um, I'm continuing my uh, experiment with the chroma key and I've put it just behind me and maybe, maybe a foot behind me and um, there doesn't seem to be any issues with shadows. Now, of course, I'm not well lit. Um, you know, there's some lights way back in the corner over there, uh, but it seems to work pretty well, um, especially when we get to um, the game itself. Um, although my hair is kind of like <laughs> fuzzing in and out, but uh, if we ignore that. All right, so let's get back to the game. All right, so I've got a settler coming next turn, and I'm exploring over here. I'm gonna keep going in this direction. Found some bananas, some stone. So I've got stone up here, so it's not super important that I've found stone there, but it's still good to have. <clears throat> All right, so. Look at my little city sprawling around. Look at this fire over here. It's pretty neat. Um, and uh, some little huts over here near the my quarry. All right, so let's go to my builder for his last charge. Some more housing, some more production. And I'm working towards craftsmanship, or craftsmanship has approved. All right, so I don't need my warrior to stay there anymore because he doesn't have to protect anybody. I am going to want him to protect my settler coming up. So I'm going to move him out here, get him in place for when the settler comes out. And uh, so my intention is to uh, is to capture this copper if there's an a sieve like right here. Now, Preslav is probably not going to be happy about this, but I think I'm far enough away I should be able to settle the city. All right. And five turns to archery, and three turns to a foreign trade, which I'm excited about as well. All right, so we'll hit next turn on that one. Um, so, submit that file. So you'll see here... I've got my new, um, let me load this before I forget. Well, so we can start the next game going. So I think when I played with the options in the Civ audio, if I come click over here, yeah, now it won't be interrupted by, um, um, by the Sean Bean's narration of the Chinese. Uh, so yeah, so this is my new um, uh, my new overlay that I'm kind of considering as a generic overlay for everything. Um, not a hundred percent sure uh, exactly how I'm going to use it, um, but there we go. Uh, oh, let's start this turn. All right, so I'm heading towards a goodie hut over here with my war warrior. And looks like I got money from the goodie hut, which is good. Um, oh yeah, so this war cart was built um, 
in a turn that Dan had sent me where I... He had had to rewind the turn on the other game that I just played. I thought he had re rewound both uh, games. So I loaded this up without loading up OBS and it didn't seem to make sense to um, to load up OBS for, uh, you know, just one move over and then hitting next turn. Um, so yeah, so this is my, my new overlay that I'm considering for everything. Um, and uh, so... You know, I've, my overlays have evolved quite a bit from very busy looking overlays um, back when I first started this uh, three or four years ago um, to right now where what I want to do, especially when I've got the ability to set up the chroma background, is to really expose as much of the game as possible and not, um, not contain the game or myself into a square. Uh, and so... Um, you know, here, what I intend is on this, let's see, it's always tricky because it's backwards, on this bar that's right here, um, I'm not sure if I'm going to have the last donation, or if I'm going to have my total and the goal, or maybe all three, although that might get a bit cluttered, we'll see. Um, and, uh, yeah, so the, you know, it's, you can, it's a, a background that's not at full opacity, so that you can, you can see the game behind the text um but but the you know the little bar kind of helps provide a focus area as well as um make it a little bit easier to read the text and um so there'll probably still be some tweaks here and there um there's some things that i'm not sure i'm not 100 percent sure about um like um going all the way across, and I've got a non-chroma version where I've got a square there, and I'm not sure. Incorrect player turn and save file. That's weird. Let's see what happens if I save the game. Yep. Oops. It wants me to play the game again. Uh, uh, so I'm, I'm, I'm not sure exactly how I'm going to do that, but we'll... Give it a shot. Let's see. Play this one. Hmm. Oh, these uh, from the first stirrings of life beneath. These uh, PBIM bits of software are not perfect. It's one area where I wish that uh, Firaxis would um, step up instead of making this rely on third-party sites. Um, that's kind of annoying. But it is what it is. Let's go back into that, see if it loads me back up where I'm supposed to be. I'll give it one more shot, and if it works, it works. If not, I'm not going to worry about it. Um, one of my brothers can rewind the turn. Yeah, so I got 40 gold from that. Save my game. Submit the file. Yeah, it's still complaining about the player turn, so... Uh, I'll we'll figure that out, but not while you guys are sitting here watching. Whatever, I'm just going to get the goodie hut next time anyways. So, um, thanks for watching. Please, um, if you have the means, donate. Um, the money is for the kids. Um, my donations go to Johns Hopkins Children's Center. And uh, I really appreciate it. So, um, this has been Eric playing Civ 6 multiplayer. I'll see you next time. Bye.